Welcome to AFOX number one stop to entertainment and trending news. Now, Vera Sadika is trending across all social media platforms. She's trending at number one on Twitter. And this is because she no longer has her backside. The voluptuous, curvy figure that she used to have. And she's put out that she removed whatever she had on her back. Now, this has raised a debate. Vera you told us you are all natural. And as you can see, this is the current state of Vera She was very honest. She removed perhaps it was back implants. Maybe she got silicone injection. We don't know. But she's promised to let her fans know what really happened. Now, there are netizens who strongly believe that Rhea Siddiqua is just clout chasing. There was a time where she shared she had gone completely to a natural skin color and she later changed. So, some netizens feel that this is just showbiz. You know, this is what Rhea Siddiqua had shared. The rebirth. This has been the hardest phase in my life. Due to health risk and complications, I had to undergo surgery. It's still very unbelievable, but I've come to terms with it and learned to love myself regardless. Ladies, please learn to love yourself and don't ever let peer pressure rush you into things that will ruin you in the future. I'm lucky to be alive. God loves me so much. Honestly, it's been pretty hard. I didn't even celebrate my birthday this year, but here we are. Happy birthday to me. New me. I've come to appreciate life and never take things for granted. Thanks to my family, especially my husband, for being there for me. To my fans, I'm still the same sweetest to Rasidika and that hasn't changed. I appreciate your love and support and pray you will walk through this journey with me. I will be posting my surgery journey videos here for those who have been thinking of getting booty surgery or changing anything on their bodies. This might change your mind. Peace and love. And so netizens have been making reference to what Vasilika had put out before. And this is just one of her Insta stories where she was asked, is it true that you did surgery a hug? I love you though. She responded, not true. My booty is natural, but my boobs, teeth, and skin complexion are fake. In fact, hopefully after delivery, I'd want a smaller booty. I'm told running on the treadmill helps. Honestly, it's too big. I don't like it. And so there you have Vera Sadika, and not the first time that she has put out that she is completely natural when it comes to her booty, but when it comes to her boobs, her teeth, and her skin, then those are the only areas of her body that she's worked on. So as you can see, though, those are very encouraging and very um, happy that Vera Sadika has used herself to pass a lesson also to young girls to not just follow trends. And you see, you're courageous, not easy to speak out happy belated birthday Siddika. Somebody says Davi your health comes first and if this makes you healthy then why not? I still love you her nothing changes. And somebody also says Mama Asia he ni edit banner. The nyash is not nyashing anymore and you can see them laughing somebody says then why do you keep on misleading the girls to get the BBL uplifts? But you always said it's real. Now, there are several comments of people reminding Rasidika, you told us that your booty is real. Why are you telling us right now that it seems you did something to it? Well, perhaps, you know, as a socialite, her booty was her brand. Basically, what put her on the map was her figure itself. So maybe this is not something that she was open about, talking about. Or exposing the real reason where she got her calves but through the years that we have gotten to know Vera there have always been comparisons of her back in the days her behind and right now so netizens have been calling it out saying that this is not real but she has always stood her grounds that everything about her is natural besides her skin teeth and boobs well for those who might think that Vera is clock chasing as you can see she went ahead to say the side effects and risk of bad implants and surgeries do exist. The complications are unbearable. Some people don't make it out alive. Some are lucky enough to survive it. Ladies, don't ever do this to yourselves. And she even went ahead to share some images of what happened to ladies who did the bad surgery. And as you can see, she said, I used to think otherwise. Maybe they went to bad doctors, etc. But that's not true. Surgeries do have consequences sometimes. Please be careful. You only believe it when reality hits. So as you can see, she's accepting and letting netizens know that it's not about 
having good doctors sometimes surgeries have complications even if you go to the best and you just know that until reality hits and she's referencing to herself now like i told you guys earlier resnika has promised her fans that she will be giving them all the deeds she will not be hiding anything she will be doing a series on her youtube channel as well and as you can see she wrote i will be posting videos of my surgery journey here from preparations to the actual procedure in the theater it's been a journey but i'm so grateful i got a good team that did their best and looked after me i will forever be grateful to them i did go through counseling as well acceptance is important and this has made me strong and have courage to come out i want to discourage ladies that think surgery fixes it not it doesn't it will only renew well i think as much as many people are making fun of this situation and making fun of Vasilika, i honestly feel that she's been very courageous to come out i can't imagine you know this has been her brand and she's coming out and letting people know the truth that it is not real and the other thing is that i have been going through health issues because of what i did to myself she had the option perhaps to do the surgery and keep mom about it and put on those vigodoros that people put on to create that illusion that they have a booty but she chose to just go the honest way and let people know that this is how i look right now and not cover it she also had the option of coming out and say that she has had a bad reduction and show the illusion by putting those vigodoros but she hasn't and this has saved perhaps one or two girls who are planning to go into surgery so i think uh, she has been very brave to come out and subject herself of course to trolls and all that but she chose herself and her health first so i think that is something commendable using a position to also pass a lesson to others who might be thinking to do what she did anyway we will be following this journey with Rasidika. let's just see if it's fake as many people have refused to believe that this is the new Rasidika. they feel it is cloud chasing but Rasidika has put out that she is not anyway thank you so much for watching we're up to date please subscribe if you haven't also turn on your post notification so notified once your uploads are up i'll see you on the next one bye bye, bye.